Hello, welcome back. We're on our episode two commentary. Yay! I'm joined here with my co-host, Dag. Hello. Uh, and two of our contestants, uh, Roman Penguin. Hello. And Glantern. Hello. And my wonderful map maker, Ari Don, who made our sentry maze uh, for this map. Or, or episode, sorry. All right. Hello. Now... <laughs> Stop with your right, key I voice. <laughs> point out that the hole there, there was a scene that I don't think is in the extended version either. I just stand there punching it, pretending to fix it, and they time it so it just when I punch it, the wood comes on. I didn't know we were planning that. And it was like, oh! And I'm actually sad it's not in it. Uh, well, yeah, we even watched you do it, and it's like we make jokes about how. Yeah, we were like, that's part like, of it. Like, like fixing tools. <laughs> Oh no, I um, I now add a little on the extended. I always add a little funny. It's either funny or behind the scenes video, and it's supposed to it's supposed to it would usually be around that week. And I used a, another one, which really clarifies what they have to do waiting. If we're trying to figure something out, they have to stand. They they have to be standing and waiting for us. And it's like it was me and Dag. I got my numbers mixed around, and I, and Dag told me I don't know how to count and you know all that fun stuff but anyway um, I do I did have that obviously but I needed a little bit extra time to get this right up to 30 minutes so I chose that one so you'll see the clip eventually it's it's pretty funny so yeah, I do this challenge <laughs> yeah oh this this went better than I expected like they perform everyone performed better than I expected I was annoyed that everyone keep finding things before I got a chance to get a, sh a shot at it you got the highest score. I know, I know. I I'm, a, I'm, I'm very competitive. I, I saw every time I saw something, I was like, oh, I wish oh, I got. I it. only won by three points. I would win by five. <laughs> <laughs> you won it all of them. But uh, this map they're playing on is Snail Dab. I think Dag backwards, I, correct? Yeah, it's Badlands. Yeah, it, it's it's mirrored. Yeah, this is yeah. this is the one of the names when you can hear me say the start. I took half an hour to come up with the perfect pronunciation. And I was worried I was gonna, still going to fuck it up. But... Was it Dee Dee that made fun of it? <laughs> she did. And <laughs> I, I think I'd pick on her through this episode <laughs> for it. But, I uh... it was, uh, no, I thought it was like Nova who said, like, uh, uh, made like a crack at uh, how you pronounced it. Uh, she yeah, just picked I... on everyone, yeah. as usual. Mm -hmm. Don't forget if it changed. Oh, we got she picked on Dee Dee for a completely different reason, though. <laughs> did I? Yeah. You, uh, you, I think you actually hear it in the short version too. What I do? Um, it was oh yeah, just, she uh, tower, she she tricked yeah, down in front of her. Oh, <laughs> it's. I guess we'll go ahead and get to that since I think by the time we get to it, um, the second part of this is you know kill each other. And I said if someone wants to go ahead and opt out, because I said if technically if everyone opts out, then you challenge is done and get all the scrap but no one gets an advantage and Dee, Dee uh she pretty much only does demo man like that's kind of her class and she even claims mm -hmm. i'm not even good at that class either but she is you know she always doubts herself but anyway um so she uh just opted out which she didn't have a suicide button so i slayed her <laughs> but <laughs> it, it's not shown because it's kind of it's, it's kind of an odd thing to have to oh, I thought that was a joke. <laughs> kind of cut, you know, kind of cut in. So I was like, since a lot of the footage is kind of cut out, I don't think you'd really notice that she got, you know, she did get killed. Because when it gets down to the last part where it's like it's uh, Glanturn versus Dusk, that's the only thing that really matters. So uh, the last thing before this challenge is over, this this map, I already forgot the guy's name, but um, there's a guy I got uh, whenever I was looking around on props for like the studio. And uh, even other custom maps. This was on the Tip Two Maps website, and uh, this user he has mirrored I think eight official maps in total. He he's done in two packs, and this is in the series two one. I was like, I feel like this is a map that most people play on. So it's a re it really screws up with you, you know? <laughs> yeah, it's weird. Uh, this map mirrored. Yeah, I yeah, enjoyed I... this challenge. Because it let me do like WWE style commentary, and here comes Dusk Chronicle. <laughs> I was afraid that like people would find me, like because Dad kept saying, "Oh, there's Glanthorn." <laughs> like, like, oh no! That's that, that was partially I was, like, what worried. I was like, oh, I want to run away. Well, that was our job. I mean, Dad's job is to just keep egging, egging on. Yeah, I just, I just kept waiting for people to you know hurt each other, and I just, and I tried my best to get in and swoop the kill. And 
And I was annoyed. Uh, not to spoil it, because if you're watching the commentary before you've actually watched the actual video, there's something wrong with you. Which, who does like, that? Who does that? I was annoyed that this ended in a tie, and I was like, oh, no, no one standout winner. How do we decide? Yeah. You can actually hear me being confused, like, how the fuck do we decide this? <laughs> <laughs> and, like, I thought one. I just won, I was like, ah, I win. <laughs> yeah, I didn't notice that, too. I got oh, yeah, this is the part where... Let's um, wait, let's wait. The part where oh, yeah. against uh, G, I believe. And, uh, I actually didn't know Dusk was hot, was still in the game, so uh, I, don't really, I don't. I remember. I remember <laughs> yeah, getting, we hear me die. I go shit. And I yeah, I remember getting Roman. The end of it. And if we weren't using the airstrike, I bet you he would have got me because the air, I had extra shots on my uh, my airstrike. I had to reload yeah. right after that last shot. Yeah, basically he had more rockets than me. Yeah. I got like I had a crit in there, but that was but I I basically had nothing in my clip. I did notice the health kits on this map. Mm -hmm. I think the health probably. Kits were still there. Oh, dusty. Yeah, yeah. We were still yeah, we were using those. <laughs> I, I was a wondering lot. maybe if it might have fared better if there were absolutely no health kits and you had to. Well, one thing it I could think. Different. Well, technically, yeah. um, during the season, I used some custom weapons, which that's what um, during the our first episode, that's what Ari Don. I'm, I'm sorry, I had Ari Don in my head. Zestry and Gangster was what we were using. And um, I had to actually force give, um, I think, Dee Dee, uh, someone else, somebody else, Squirrel. and Squirrel well, and the I, airstrike. I, I remember giving Dee Dee a Because uh, they didn't have it. And technically, if I was going to be really mean, I could have made it where their airstrike could not pick, you couldn't pick up health. So, anyway, so now Miss. this challenge. So, Here you uh, go. Take the floor. Awesome yep. So this map was uh, very fun to create. Most of the work, as you can see in the little trailer video, is put into probably about this entrance here with the whole rock face. And uh, we originally did the maze. And I guess there was some, some problem with the footage. Yeah, we'll, we'll get to that after. <laughs> okay. I, I would have liked to have about? done more with the oh, maze yeah, itself. Is... Because as you'll see, when they go into the maze, it's just nothing but endless, all identical hallways. But I guess in the end, it probably would have fared better that way because then you just had no idea where you were. You couldn't use anything as the point of reference, which uh, which we'll we'll see with a few of these people. Mm -hmm. I think Dust I... gets close to the end on this run, and then I he decides love... that he wants to go a completely opposite direction. <laughs> just dead. <laughs> In which we'll we'll mention that, Dust. I as one thing I wanted, I wanted someone to do an actual enter enter one path and basically do a big old loop around and actually exit through another path or at the start. And Dust does that. I was like, yes. Yep. Now you can actually see the point where Dust skips the en skips the enter exit. I mean, you mm -hmm. know, loop around. Yeah, I think a few people do that. I think Glanter did that as well. He went into the ex ex the exit, then came back out, then went back in again. Yeah, yeah, you went sure. into the actual hallway. I, I saw that on the second run. You went into scary. the hallway, but you didn't quite go far enough because one of the things I wanted to do while I designed this maze is that I didn't want to make the entrance on the same level as the maze because then if you were looking down the hallway, you would instantly recognize it as the end and it would be, you know, be really easy. Yeah, turn so one of, the things, one of the things I wanted to do was make it so that when you're running through the maze, you're not quite sure if you're at the end until the floor just gives way and you'll... You'll see that. Yeah, that's what I. That's why I basically wanted to, in summer, is like didn't want to. Yeah, yeah now, that fog yeah. really, really helped for this. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Originally, yeah. I did have the end, the end at the, uh, on the same level as the maze. But if you were standing, anywhere near the exit, you would be able to see all the lights down in that hallway and know, instantly, to to go there. We don't want, that. Don't want that. I don't know thing. if it was mentioned, but was 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 it mentioned that. We got to pick a class with the scout and the heavy. Yeah, the yeah. heavy and the scout. I think everyone went heavy. I think. Yeah, or, uh, there was a point. There was a point where like we had maybe the first one we had maybe like one or two scouts, but everyone else went heavy for the extra metal. Yeah. It was like three scouts and one heavy on one, and then it was like three heavies and one scout on the other. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that was what it was. I so guess. I am curious mm -hmm. about. Because I never tested this map with the sentries, and I never saw it be tested with the sentries. I'm wondering, from the contestant himself, Glantern, mm -hmm. how were? Did you hear the sentries at all, or was it very easy to avoid them, or did you have issues with them as you're going through the maze? Um, 
Well, I really heard it. it. I just, I heard it. I was like, oh, maybe I should back away. And then I just quickly kind of jumped to the side. Um, oh, yeah, that was actually I, something uh, Frafting told us. The sentries don't make noise. Oh, yes. Unless they don't make, make the noise. That's, they had a very slow response, too. Uh, that's what I was going to mention. Um, I forgot to mention on our first episode. Uh, I asked, see, he's actually made a couple of custom plugins, which for this episode included. Um, Taking away the beeping sounds of the sentry, so you couldn't actually hear them until you was actually right, uh, you know, right next to in it. In the range. In the range. <laughs> Tee hee. Yep. And then yeah, that, look, look at that, that uh, extra head start there. Yeah. 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 yeah and there's I mean, me falling behind you. Didn't do a damn thing. It didn't help you much. Now, one thing that I oh, what was I going? I was going to say something. Fucking got cut off. Um. <laughs> one oh, thing that. Uh, I was hoping that we could probably add in the future if we ever did this challenge again was just okay. have random portal clips going are you there <laughs> just to just randomly play it like as a soundboard so everyone could hear it and it'll oh, just freak them out I will I'll just say technically right now I've got a button bound to play well it's just actual sounds and tip to have that bound to a button so just for my server yeah. just for I, if you're curious you it's luck, the, Mesa? <laughs> if you're curious it's the duck sound so anyway Oh, oh yeah, yeah you were excited going in and out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't sure. I was like, yep. oh, you're Fox not sure about over. the hallway, and, and then you turned around. Then Wimp yeah. takes it, and mm. then Wimp took it, and I guess you heard him. Like, Are oh, we oh, going to mention the first attempt? Really? Yes, uh, before we before this challenge gets too over. So due to complete replay corruption, which only uh, since it's on my server, I do all it's all locally, so I. More, I, it's actually I. It's only saved on my end. That's it. So if mine's corrupt, it's all lost. And I couldn't force the freaking replace it. If I, it's it's because if anyone's had replay problems, it, it your your game would crash and says um. I I forgot it. It's been a while. But anyway, but it said shotgun. It's like that or usually it names what t possible weapon screwed up the the. Uh, the replay and it's like shotgun so I was like I was running around just shooting a shotgun on the map for saving replay went to as an engineer shooting a shotgun didn't do it so I had to ask Ari Dunn very kindly for like dirt like because we had a we uh, I was like you have one week one week can you mirror the map so because they're going to run through the challenge again and I want to take away some of the familiar uh, familiarity that's a word isn't it whatever uh, of the map <laughs> Familiarity. Yeah, yeah, close enough. Anyway, remember, first episode, I'm not good at pronunciation. But anyway, um... Should, should we probably mention also that it took you an hour to set uh, up all the sentries? Okay, they blew up. I yeah. keep for... Yeah. I can't for switch the, and he switched the wrench of all things. I <laughs> was, like, I would switch the wrench, because I gave myself a custom wrench one, so it, I had to actually... The actual makes itself, the actual... Uh, each point where the sentry is... I made a wrench where it reduced the range of the sentry exactly by one fourth, and that was just enough. So if you ran around, ran you know around, around a corner, the sentry would detect you, but, but it wouldn't shoot you. And if you would run up uh, run up to a sentry that's maybe at the end of a hallway, by the time it uh, you saw it and turned back around, it may shoot you once. So like the map was actually already done, like made it perfectly somehow by one fourth. It's like it's like the first time. It's like wow, I did it by one fourth, and it's like perfect. But anyway, yeah, the the fog engineered in that map was designed specifically to be within that range limit. Mm -hmm. So by the time you saw it, it was already looking at you. Basically. But yeah, I would, I would either switch class, so that means I would get rid of my special wrench, so the sentries would get destroyed. I would just go from engineer to a spy, because I wanted to be able to float around the map and be invisible. I did it like probably three times, maybe? Oh, oh my god. So yeah, accidentally like, switched uh, classes and blew uh, up all that hard Yeah. Work. At least I got the maze down, so, um, yeah. There's a reason why I've suggested that the the kind of like subtitle to TF2 Mole Season Three is "fuck crafting." <laughs> this is one of them. It, I messed my, I made myself up. Uber. <laughs> you try to. You hear me just going. You lost eight, eight seconds. Good luck. Yeah, that Uber and charge that last, didn't and help. Right as what I was saying, as right as I there was fuck this i'm out of here and i hit my explosion key and that's what killed me mm -hmm. i didn't actually oh, i didn't actually catch that so hopefully let's, let's let's cut this here so it doesn't end up longer than the first one so i'd like <clears> to <throat> thank again uh dag for his, his help for during the season of course Ari Don for the map that he made for this episode and maybe another one coming up yeah. thank you kitty uh roman penguin and also glantern for uh 
Hang lanterns. I, I mean, uh, Roman. Oh, thing. There yeah. you go. <laughs> I just said it together. I'm sorry. So. Roman Glantern. Ro Glant. Glant. Romance. Oh, I, I can't think of it. Anyway, so we'll see you on the next one.